Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is action from La Liga Profesional de Football. It's Tigre, and they face Aldo Sidi. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre. It's a good team. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full-back and winger, and of course the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And the game begins. Menossi. Difficult to stop him. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And it might be. Still a chance. Well, that looked to be quite dangerous, but just a fraction off. Well, let's have another look at this. And these are fine margins, aren't they? But he's offside and the officials have got this spot on. Matias Pisano. Well, he's given us away. Real chance. Oh dear, oh dear. The goal was at his mercy. Tame effort. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, he's been brilliant for them. He's their leading goal scorer, and his general play in the top third of the pitch has been so clever. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. And just slightly offside. Menossi. Alexis Castro has it. Throw ins given. It needs an accurate cross. must take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming well just look at the bend he puts on this it's good technique and perfect placement that's a top quality finish
Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Silva has it. Excellent passing. Maciel. And that pass could be troublesome. Matias Pisano. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. And giving it away. Useful looking position, you've got to say. There to win it back. And Silva. Martin Cautaruccio. It's with Meli. It should be! And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Well, nearing the half-time interval, and suffice it to say, they're not making great use of home advantage. Stuart, your assessment? I have to say, Derek, they haven't played well. They've been slow in possession, they've been poor defensively, and they've lacked a cutting edge. They need to perform much better than this. And back with Silva. Gives it a go. Good stop from the keeper. Now, how about the short corner? Body in the way. Meli. Showing a real will to ball. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. The first half here comes to an end. Well, quite simply, he hasn't been able to make his mark an attack in this game, Stuart. Well, I've been disappointed with his game so far. As those touches show us, he just hasn't been getting into the right sort of areas. That's got to be improved if they're to get back into this one. So, back underway here, into the second half. keeper is happy the bar was there and the danger is averted well they can all calm down now Derek they've got away with that one you have to say well I have to say I thought that looked to be going in it was such a good effort Colidio it's with Lucas Menossi he's given it straight to the opposition He has teammates around him. Superb block. Could reduce the deficit. Oh dear. 
that moment might come back to haunt them. A bad miss. You sense that had to go in if they're to turn this around. They simply haven't been at the races today. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stuart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. So a half an hour remaining. Poor pass under no real pressure. Silva with it. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Counter-attacking very much an option. A bit of running room now on the wing. But timely defending when it mattered. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. Well, he's lost it. 20 minutes to go in this one. And the emphasis is on creativity. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Promising looking ball. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And Silva. Silva with it. And just wide of a target, goal kick. Well, I think the goalkeeper had it covered, but it was a decent effort, though. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Well, nearly there, this game almost over. And looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear to me to be more than a bit gutted. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. He's going forward well here, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they keep it going? Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Can someone get on the end of this? Opportunity in the wide area. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most. And with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today.